So this is going to be a short video on metric conversions. I have my, I call it my King Henry Died chart up here. And the way I remember it is Great and Mighty King Henry Died. This is the base. Drinking chocolate milk under the new princess. You can see that these all stand for a metric prefix like giga, mega, kilo, hecta, deca, deci, centi, milli, micro, nano, and pico. There are three spaces in between giga and mega, three between mega and kilo. Between kilo and milli, each one just is one space. And then from milli to micro is three, micro to nano is three, and nano to pico is three. So the chart is really easy to use metric to do metric conversions. So let's say that I had the number 24.3. This is decagrams, and I'm wanting to convert that to decagrams. So on my chart, I would go to deci, and I would count over one, two spaces to get to deca. So this my decimal point is going to go one, two spaces left. So my number would be 0.243. I could also do this if I had a very small number. And we'll say that this is mega liters, and I would like to go to liters. So on my chart, I'll start with mega, and I'll count over till I get to my base, which is liters. So I go one, two, three, four, five, six spaces right. So my decimal point is going to go one, two, three, four, five, six spaces right, and this would be 79.1 liters. So whichever way you move on the chart and however many spaces, that's the same way and the same number that you're going to move your decimal point in your number to do your conversion.